Are you filming something for the others again? Uh -huh. Oh, welcome back! Checked out that base. It's clear. Want to split up the spells that just dropped before we go take it? Sounds good. Dibs on Sword Flash. Huh? Huh? It's a battle lock, but we're not in a fight. I wouldn't be so sure. But some kind of trap? <laughs> hey, easy! <laughs> Why are you... What the hell, man? <laughs> hey, are all you boys and girls out there ready for the real fun to begin? just from the end of day two. For some reason it hasn't been archived on Libra, but it's spread among the students all the same. I see. That does explain the weird mood today. Guess that means Sionji isn't the only person the doppelganger can impersonate. Impossible! Uh -oh. What we're seeing uh -oh. right now is unprecedented! Wait, am I crazy or is that a different image? For that matter, why does Kazumi sound so out of it? Hmm. First, we need to figure out how this doppelganger thing works. Hmm, hmm. I have been wondering, what is she? Well, she burst into the scene, guns blazing, claiming to be the true Empress. But it looks like in reality, she can assume the appearance of anyone she wants in Astral. What? Then she could just transform herself into any one of us and strike? <laughs> <laughs> Truly, preventative measures will be crucial to us going forward. So you're saying, don't give her the opportunity to body snatch us, right? There's a couple things we can do, but the most important is that we keep each other in sight. To that end, we should be traveling in groups of no fewer than two. That clear? Yes, reasonable. Providing no one goes carelessly running off by themselves, that should work out. <laughs> uh... Uh, no! Inferno Strike! What the? Oh, lost again! Hey, it's 2 a.m. Don't you have to go to school in the morning or something? Uh, why would I? If I went outside, I'd have to talk to dull strangers and stuff. So I'd rather just stay in and enjoy myself. You don't have a problem talking to me. Yeah, but that isn't the same. You're special, mister, and I like you. Oh. <laughs> hey, I'm not a pillow. I really should get going. It's me, your accomplice. Oh, give me ten minutes. What? Ten minutes? That's way too long. Fine, five, five minutes. Just wait there. Out here in the hall? Come in. Okay. Hey, it's just a room. 
quit looking around so much. Huh? Right. Oh, that doesn't mean you should stare at me instead. Then where am I supposed to look? Why not out there, at all the lovely glittering lights? Pretty, aren't they? Can you imagine the headlines if anyone saw me here? Passionate love between seven-star transfer student and genius princess exposed. Ew! But passionate love? Don't be such a dummy! Anyone with half a brain knows that I'm way out of your league. Do you mind if I at least sit down? I actually came here to talk to you. It's about the doppelganger. <sighs> That's not surprising. Everything is about her these days. It's honestly kind of exhausting. Having to watch someone hijack your appearance to get attention. It doesn't help that she's such a charismatic diva. You'd think there'd be more of an outcry over identity theft. Society's weird. They've already taken to calling her Miss Hundred Faces. It's bad. People are gonna develop trust issues real fast over this. Some teams might even self-destruct out of suspicion. Really wish I could disagree with that. But I know for a fact my own team's a prime candidate for implosion. It's rough, but then... So is having one day to take out two more commanders, under imminent threat of losing my leadership. Uh, you have what? How the heck are you not freaking out about this? Hey, don't worry. It's not like I'm underprepared or anything. So, does that mean you've got some kind of plan? I do. In fact, that's kind of the whole reason I snuck over to talk to you. I've got a way to dominate this competition, even with Miss Hundred Faces in the way. <laughs> we need to take more bases. Look, let's just grab this one first and then we can readjust. Yeah, sure. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Hey, come on, man! Don't do this! Slow down, Nanase. You're too far ahead. You can still see me, can't you? I'm just doing my job as the team soldier and leading the way, all right? <laughs> you not being in my line of sight isn't the issue. It's that once again, you're being careless. Nothing's mm. stopping you from walking How faster, troublesome. You know? Man, if you wish, Master, I could try to intervene. Uh, no. I should do it myself. What the? Oh. What is this? Watch it, Hito. This has got to be that crazy ability blackout. Not good. I can't see a thing. How will I know if someone got replaced? Answer me quickly, Nanase. What was the gift you got me for my birthday last year? Huh? I don't know. That was ages ago. Why? Are you suggesting I miss hundred faces? Just answer the question, would you? It's still me, you dolt. But with the way you're acting, how can we be sure it's you? Oh, man. This is bad. What do I do? Uh Hey, Nanase, where are you going? We've still got- No, we don't. I'm done with your second guessing. So, just go ahead and play without me. What? <laughs> Wait, Nanase! <sighs> I'm sorry. I need to go clear my head. Nanase and I probably shouldn't play this afternoon. No, I think we probably shouldn't play at all. You're backing out? But what about the leadership bet you have going with Master? Right, the bet. Look, let's just say I wasn't cut out for the position to begin with and leave it at that. Man, so high strung. Would it kill them both to be a little more easygoing? <sighs> no shows, huh? Can't believe they actually sat out. Players can't join a game session once it's underway. The earliest they can rejoin us will be tomorrow. Well, it's done. The best we can do is carry on as discussed and see this through. Hmm? Hey, I know you only just started, but you're surrounded! Uh. Himeji, Akizuki, huh? we've got two teams inbound from the north and south. We're about to be flanked! Uh-oh. I'd wager that the person who used Blackout is on one of those teams. Uh. Aww, just when it starts to feel like a date, it gets ruined. Man. Well, I don't much mind the dispelling of your delusions part. I very much do mind being flanked. If their intention with the ambush this morning was to divide us, they'll be coming in for the kill. Yeah, that makes sense. Huh. 
Will our plan really work? Not that I'm at all doubting our abilities. I mean, you and I are the most powerful power couple out there. And as third wheels go, your mate friend is kind of useful. But maybe we should run. Her attribution of third wheel status is clearly misassigned, though her concerns are not unfounded. It's true. The odds are against us here. But I think I've got the answer. <laughs> so fate brings us together again, Mr. Seven Star. Why did it have to be the Demon Maiden? Sorry that we're a couple short. I've been hoping to face you with a full team. No need to apologize. After all, I'm the one who set the stage for that dramatic spat earlier. <laughs> You're just freely admitting it? Not as straight-laced as you seem, huh? The time's come to say goodbye. Master, we'll leave the demon to you. <laughs> Why are they coming at us? Um, maybe we should split up! <laughs> you must have a death wish. Do you really think you can face me on your own? Just hold it! There's one of you, and five of us. You're outnumbered by both bodies and spells. It's hopeless, even if you are the strongest player on the island. You've got numbers all right. A quantity will always be a poor substitute for quality. <laughs> what? But how did he... <laughs> well, that's one down. Magic Blast no joke, huh? That was your spy, right? You're gonna pay for that! At your service as always, Master Shinohara. Good work. That was perfect, Himeji. <laughs> Good old misdirection. They think Shinoyuki's gone off with Noah, then BAM! Surprise attack! <sighs> Question is, was that enough to disrupt the conditions for her one-shot kill? Yeah. Master, look out! That paltry barrier is the only reason you're still here. Even with it, that took off most of your life points. Come on, retreat! Right. <sighs> what is this? <clears throat> the audacity! <clears throat> A counteract spell? What, trying to leverage the playing field bonus? Yeah, is that what you think? The distraction's working, but we can't get complacent. The Maiden's one-shot kill isn't disarmed yet. I've got an idea. I might have a way for us to even things out. If we can make it work, it may eliminate one of their members. It'll take risking my life to do it, though. Knowing that, would you be willing to put your trust in me? Yeah, of course. You've had nothing but my complete faith since the moment I met you. All right. Thank you, Master. I can't allow you to go any further. Himeji? <gasps> oh, angling to use the same trick twice, are we? Who can say? If you think you can stop me, you're welcome to try. All right, then. You asked for it. <laughs> Damn it! What was that? Just numerical adjustment. <gasps> Absurd! Attack spells are programmed to deal damage to a targeted player based on various numeric values. By recalculating the timing and trajectory, it's possible to redirect the fairy attack itself. She calculated all that in a few seconds? That's unbelievable! Guess she's not the company's lead for nothing! <sighs> what are you? A monster? I'm simply a maid, loyally in the service of my master. Hiroto Shinohara. Is that answer enough? Demon. This fight's more difficult than I thought it'd be. But I'm not worried. Their spells have to run out eventually. <laughs> no way. I didn't see them use trap. And that's three what? down. Don't look so surprised. Our little devil has a knack for anticipating people's movements. She's been dropping her beloved traps all over while we've been at it. <laughs> so that's it, huh? Her going after the Kagurazuki pair was just a ploy. Academy Island's strongest indeed. However, this plan of yours has one vital flaw. Which is? In your bid for defense, you've overdone the counteract spells. You haven't really left yourself much scope for attack. 
Yeah? How would you know how many- 35 times! Oh. You've used Counteract 35 times since we started. Accounting for the one magic blast you fired off, there shouldn't be a single spell left in your personal slots. Seriously? How was she able to keep count during all of that? Not so oh. fast. Master still has me by his side, don't forget. If you want to get at him, then you'll have to go through his maid before that. Himiji! Huh. <laughs> Medusa's magic eye. It's an ability that stops an opponent's movement for one minute. That sure sounds handy. With this, our victory is all but guaranteed. Is it? What about your one-shot kill, though? Don't you need your teammates help to use it? <laughs> On the contrary, one-shot kill is by nature at its most lethal when its users fighting solo. Huh? But this contest is a team battle. So in a show of solidarity, I overrode its primary condition for activation, necessitating the presence of allies to use it. Now I must undo that restriction. Please forgive me for this act of cowardice. <gasps> The harsh truth is, I've always been strongest alone. I'll make you regret belittling us. Now prepare yourself. <sighs> One shot kill! <laughs> that shouldn't be possible. All your slots should be empty by now. <laughs> Yeah, it's true that a bunch of spaces got turned to green, but in thinking I took them, you fell right for it. Fell for what? My black wings, of course. <gasps> it's an ability that lets me control visual effects, so I just tweak the color. In actuality, I've barely dipped into my personal slots at all. Huh? Hey! Wait, what's going on? Electronic interference. My trump card. For Suyuri's honor and my own. I can't allow myself the luxury of falling here. Uh, hey! Uh. Uh. That was expertly handled, Master. Himiji. The demon maiden. She's quite adept in battle, isn't she? Her intuition and resourcefulness are peerless. But wasn't that kind of odd? Why didn't she finish me? All she had to do was throw out one more attack spell. I was helpless. It does seem strange. Perhaps she had a reason not to. Hirata! Hmm? <laughs> I hunted those two skittish guys down like dogs and ended them. So, didn't I do good? Uh, yeah. Yeah, you did. I wouldn't have made it without you. All right! But wait, something's not quite adding up. We just eliminated Kagurazuki, didn't we? So then, why hasn't Aimee's area increased oh. any? <laughs> You're right. It hasn't. Wait a sec. I remember something. Before I took out those two guys, they said they were under Miss Hundred Face's umbrella. What could that mean? Either way, I can't imagine all this weirdness is unrelated. Could it be him? Up to his old tricks again? Gotta play this right. From here on, it's all or nothing. All right, look. I need you to trust me and listen closely. Huh? <laughs> Please accept my deepest apologies. I saw the live broadcast. Nana say too. Thanks to my profound arrogance, you were put into a situation you never should have been in. Enomoto, tell me and be honest. Did you ever actually suspect that Asamiya was really Miss Hundred Faces? No. I only said that because I wanted to make her mad. She's foolish, but she's honest and pure. No one can fake that. She was putting on a brave face, but I could tell she was off. I thought if she was out of the game... Why are you looking at me like that? Oh, oh, uh, I'm just kind of surprised you're opening up to me. <sighs> it's something that's always on my mind. But it's not always easy mm -hmm. to say, you know? Uh... Oh? trying to eavesdrop on you, I promise! How much of that did you hear, Nanase? Answer or so help me, I will wipe your memory clean! I, uh, came in around when you were saying, I totally have the hots for Nanase, so like the tail in. I didn't say anything of the sort! That doesn't even sound remotely like me! Hey, you said, she's always on my mind. 
No, I did it! What? You practically said that verbatim. <laughs> I noticed something when I watched the video on Libra. Uh -huh. While we were negotiating with the Ibra Academy guys, one of them was preparing a magic blast spell. I noticed when I slowed it down to one-tenth speed. It was the guy Asamiya attacked. So that was it. You weren't being impulsive, were you? You did what you did to help us. I just want to do my part for the team like everyone else. Shino's tough and seriously resourceful. Noah's cute and super clever. Yuki's just as cute and has brains for days. Then there's you. While I wouldn't exactly call you cute, you have a grounding presence people can count on. The only thing I can do is sling a sword. That's why you reacted so abnormally quickly? What else could I do? I saw it going down. Not that any of that matters now. It's pretty much over, right? We've got no area, no spells, our popularity's on the wane, and Shinohara, our premier player, has been eliminated. Hold up. Did you say he's been eliminated? He was. Shino got eliminated from Astral at the end of the day. He did it to himself. All right, look. I need you to trust me and listen closely. <laughs> Why would you do that? Hang on, was this just so you wouldn't lose our bet? I'm not gonna lie. Satisfying the bet was one reason. But it wasn't the only one. Are you trying to say that you being eliminated will somehow help Aimee win? Miss Hundred Faces has turned Astral upside down. She now has whole teams working under her umbrella. And among her opponents, we're bottom of the pile. We can't win playing by the book. But I wouldn't worry. After all, everything's going according to plan. I'm